let's now see this message. A terminal connection point has too many targets. 3. Maximum number of targets allowed would be 2. This means that we tried to connect 3 wires into one terminal. Normally the maximum would be 2 wires. Let's first click on the message, then right click and then go to graphic to locate the problematic terminal and let's unzoom to see where the problem lays over here. Of course I'm more experienced and I already see the problem. So I tried to connect this line, this line and this line to one terminal. There are two ways you can solve this message. The first way would be some, some sort of cheating. You would go to the terminal, symbol function data and then logic and let's see which connection point is this. So the first and the second. So we're going to concentrate on the first connection point, which is going to be above. And say for this one, number of targets, we would say three. As said, this is some sort of cheating. I wouldn't recommend this. But just to show you that we also have this option in case you need it at some other places. And since we now made this change, Let's go to check project once again and run it. OK. So it seems like we now solve this message. As I said, this was some sort of cheating. So let's go once again to revert this and say one more time too. When we change something in ePlan that is not natural, so according to the settings for devices and everything, it's going to turn up as this yellow background. So this is just a graphical representation for us that we made some change, which is not completely correct. In any case, you have this option. So let's go back to two once again. Okay. Okay, one more time. When we would go to the check project and run it, we will probably get this message once again. So here it is. And the better solution, the correct solution will be over here. So we would connect only, of course, the incoming line and this one to this device. And the next one will change this symbol once again, place. Now hit tab key on the keyboard just once. You see over here when I click on something. And with this change in the connection representation, we now told ePlan that we are going to connect this wire and this incoming line to the terminal. And the one over here, we're gonna also connect only two wires. So the incoming line and this one. So this should be a solution to this message and now let's check project once again. OK. Seems like this was fine. Let's go to the last message. So seems like we found a solution to our current message. And that's it.